You know, I'm willing to bet that anyone who has not played any of the previous Xenoblade games and is starting off with three, in addition to be to being confused and completely uninformed about the links to the other games in this game, are probably incredibly confused if they happen to lose to the final boss and end up back on the title screen. <laughs> because it didn't say that it was going to be a game over. But at the same time, anyone who's played any of the previous games is going to know this is probably going to happen, even if they're not told that this is going to happen. Anyway, we'll come back to some more uh, of the extra long run. Try to finish the Inlay Chronicles 3. Last time we lost against the final boss, and that boots us back to the title screen in this series. Which means we gotta do this fight again. Um... We're quite well traveled by now, huh? Okay, so there is a, um... A shortcut right there. So I could, in theory... I think the handshakes are, uh, our camps, basically. Yeah, exactly. Rest spots. Let's, Let's see if we can derive run. any amount of uh, of levels here. I mean, I brought everyone to level 75, but we are almost there. Um, Let's try to build up a little bit and try to get to level 76. I definitely feel stronger. Ah! Should we get move on? Oh yeah, these guys are not aggroing on us because they're... Oh, they don't mind. I'm just gonna go for level 76. I'm not gonna spend an entire two hours grinding for levels here. Theoretically, there is not really much here that should be able to kill us. I fully expect that if I had been playing this game for myself, I'd probably be like level 85 at this point. Level 67. Yeah, I have a better idea. I should still be able to travel around here. The Taurus Hollow? No. No. Mac the Wild Wool, was it? Yeah, this, uh, this super hard area.
with uh with a checkpoint literally literally named warning tree Yeah, we got some rough, some rough customers here that we can now actually deal with. Tyon, can you please not stand in the death water? <laughs> like, of course you almost died. You were standing in the death water. Sure do. All covered. Just you watch. Counting on you, land. Also, I just realized that one is actually not a lead. Let's take it down first. Not the time to approach. Also, this is not back facing. Reactivated herself. Got a bravo out of that. It's an additional bonus experience for us. In addition to the fact that we're fighting an elite, that's more bonus experience. Thank you. Um, so, Mini Sama lands in Thailand.
Yeah, that was a good chunk of experience. Whoa, got a rare doodah right here. Let's harvest the hyena. Oh, that's a lot of hyena. <laughs> What are you doing on regular ether? Definitely worth grabbing one or two there. Oh, well, you're making us go through the death water for that. Hopefully this is worth it. Actually, it's probably not. Wonder what's inside. Ultra pure gemstone. That's neat. Looks like it's gonna rain. What level are you, friend? I should probably be. Oh, level seventy-six rain. elite. How inconvenient. Yeah, let's not fight you. Oh my goodness. I don't want to fight you, but I also want to get past you. Level 78 unique. I want to see if I can reach that question mark too. That's probably not something that I'm going to do like as part of the stream series. Can't believe I actually made it this far before. that over here okay that's for another quest Ah yes, the, the traditional go-go attack of uh, I fart in your general direction. There should be.
can feel the power. Fart. Yes, feels just like it should. <laughs> that was uh, impeccably timed. And I was the MVP. You're all thinking it. Oh, lands. You know that I want to deal with the level 75 elite. Ultra pure gemstones. It's probably used for like the highest level gems. Is that what I think it is? Oh, it's a shiny elite. We are so winning this. We are. Let's finish this already. Oh, let's see how this turns out. My guess is poorly. But at the very least, if we lose this battle, we don't get bumped back to the title screen. Unfortunately, we do get bumped back to our last uh, landmark, which is a while back. But we don't lose in experience. Okay, we're doing pretty good with this fight, actually. Better than I thought we were. I actually wouldn't mind getting a chain attack here to um, get some bonus experience. Days. You are gonna stay days for the rest of your short life. Oh, that actually exceeded. Dang. I mean, it's already overtime. <laughs> We're just increasing our experience bonus as much as possible at this point.
Just boop into that uh, chain attack song. So love it. And also an additional 250% bonus from that guy being an elite. And I think with the bonus experience, that's going to take us to level 76. Wonder what's inside. But I do want to see if we can get a um, a landmark. Maybe up this elevator is exactly what we need to do. Now we wait. How high is this going? This came back to here. Treasure appropriated. Interesting. I wasn't expecting that. We're sliding down. Unfortunately, there isn't anything interestingly leveled around here. That container. But that's fine. Um, let's go to a rest spot. All me towels right here. to make sure we're well rested. I'll start, shall I? Oh, I needed that. Oh, this is not a rest stop where I can get additional... This should be. Yeah, this is a camp. Let's make the most of our break, guys. I definitely feel stronger. Okay, we are level 76. I could just keep going and get to like level 80, but hopefully I'm not going to actually need to do that to finish this game. It's good to keep a record. All board! Adventure train ready to depart! Yeah, depart to our inevitable demise. Back to the amphitheater. And this time, at least we get to skip the uh, the cutscenes. They're really cool cutscenes, but I would not want to to sit through them the entire time. Unfortunately, we gotta do uh, phase one Z again. Stealing away your powers is trivial to me. Now mm. then, the curtain rises. Oh, that's an interlink seal specifically. I mean, it does seem to also reduce our attack power because. What I'm guessing this does is uh, change our class levels all down to one. 
in addition, of course, to preventing us from being able to enter link or chain with that. I've also got a bit of a, a new plan for dealing with uh, Zed Infinite. Basically, I want to hit the first chain attack as soon as possible, save the second chain attack for um, phase three of the fight, basically. Still maintain that this is such a dumb battle, and just the fact that you gotta do it like the fact that if you lose against Zed Infinite, then you gotta use Zed. I do feel like that didn't take quite as long, but that it still feels like it takes super long. Let's be real here. I feel like if I was emulating this, I would probably put a save state down at the beginning of the Zed Infant fight. I do wonder how well this game would emulate though. Of the uh, the chill we've up here. Can you please not do that while I'm trying to do parts. Get out of there. Achievement unlocked, stood in the fire. 
Okay, phase two coming up. I will face you as many times as you want. The struggle phase is all two, that you step are permitted. And this is, this is like the boring part of the fight. But Zed isn't even trying, why should I? Phase 2, step 2. It does annoy me as well that I can't skip this. I'm staying true to who I am, and that's the way it's going to be. Don't make it too easy for us. Got an ace up my sleeve. All right, coming right up. Only. I can follow the earth. I think the most important thing. To do in uh, in these chain attacks is get some healing out. Make sure everyone is at uh, is topped up for phase three. I, I don't know if it makes any difference to try to get a Bravo, but. I may as well try to get a battle. Stay right there. What a surprise for you. Very good. 
the first step in your so-called revolution. And now you gotta fuck off, get another shield. I shall observe carefully what you would term your strength. I wonder if that shot, like that particular shot of um, Zed snapping, has been used as switch promo material. Yeah, the, the snap that happens uh, with the uh, the Switch logo. I've always had this thing where my left... Like, I can't snap with my left uh, hand. It just comes out as this. Things I gotta come up with to stall while this while this battle is uh slowly unfolding. Considering the considering the scale of damage we're doing, that was bad. That was pretty good. Adversity. Uh, still absolute crap damage. We're not going to be doing any real damage until phase two is finally over. What will you show me next? Come now, entertain me. Are you not entertained? No. This must be pretty freaky for Mio, like specifically. Watching her body get uh, homecoming away. Got me nose. Strike through. Strike on through to the other side. 
Nearly 80,000, not bad. Okay, phase two finally done. Now it's time for phase three where we can have an actual boss battle. You would usurp me. Grasp the future. I cannot assent. The curtain closes. everyone how about this it's like I have an idea I have a better idea I should disengage just before the uh, the overheat. Actually, gotta think about this for a second. Let's not just spam everything. This this actually counts. This is for keeps. I really wish it would show facing. Uh, unless facing absolutely doesn't matter. And if you get like something that requires front or back facing, it doesn't matter which side you're on, it'll just have that extra effect. I don't know. So we've got Tyon and uh, we've got Yumi who's gonna be able to do uh, the thing. And Mia, yeah, who is our only option.
pretty close to amazing, but not quite. Finally, finishes off with an amazing. I love that line. Don't worry, me, I'm just here to end it. That did not do a whole lot of damage, honestly, but at the same time, our big damage combos have included, uh, you know. Okay, that fight's done again. Time for this. And this time, at the very least, for higher level than the boss. Up from on the boss as well. Quick being an idiot, quick being an idiot. don't need to uh to come and resurrect me showing up for any of these. We need you, girl. Oh, no. 
I was really hoping for a... Uh... Oh. Oh, now you're ready. Great. Unfortunately, we're out of resources here, you know. Uh, lands means Senna. Tion means Uni. I don't have Uni. This order is going to execute. No, we're not. We're not even going to get there. M miss it by three percent. Ass. This is going worse than the first attempt. Oh, I can actually break it. to ease herself. Thank you. 
Bachelor as fuck! Oh, it doesn't matter what I do. I drew all healers, so that's the end of the chain attack. And that's even worse than the last one! Like, holy crap! Cheering. My my reaction was Andros, but Sigma is also valid. Uh, this is my second attempt, and um, as I expected, although as I was hoping wouldn't happen, losing this fight does boot me back to the title screen, which means I get to fight regular Zed all over again. So I went, went, I went to one of those super areas that has like level 70 something enemies and uh, gained a level. I don't know if one level is going to do it, but uh, it's one level more than I have. For a double or a horror. Uh, I think, yeah, that's the idea, Tyrion. It's not a great idea, but it's an idea. But yeah, it, it also turned out that I was like a sliver of, of experience away from uh, from level 75. It is very rude. Of course, everyone gets reactivated because this is a double or over. The old double double. I'm with you. Ooh, that's pretty close. Still love that line. So this is where I died last time. 
Actually, no. Did I get through this phase? I, I think I got through this phase, yeah. So if at all possible, I'm going to try to hold on to that last chain attack until after we get to Phase 4. Because Phase 4 is where it gets messy. Right quick. I am worried that we're going to outpace. Phase four here. We might end up uh, not having chain attack ready in time. Which would be very bad. Attack's getting close. Phase 4 is getting real close. Tyon's down. Uni's down. Yikes. 3 are down. 4 are down. We still have a healer, but... We have one healer. Two healers. Okay, we have the entire party back. Uh, I'm nervous about using the chain attack now. I feel if I don't, I'm just gonna squander this fight. But I'm pretty sure there's one more phase. And I want to prevent Zed Infinite from doing anything in that phase. Doing it! Ah, oh, come on, Eno, I need you! into not necessarily a bad thing that means I'm gonna get one back and still, ha still have six maybe I'll maybe I'll get Eno this time That'd be nice thank you Sixty-five percent. You know, reactivates herself, which is very good. Ah, uh, Senna means don't use lands. 
Let's get my heals in for this round. And use all three healers. Hmm. Yeah, I want to use all three healers. I have enough for a Bravo, and I think I want to just keep it to that. Your fate was sealed when you rose against us. That's gonna be two reactivations. I've got an idea. So I've got Mio, which means Noah. I've got Senna, which means Lands. Mio has Bravo. I don't know if that makes a difference, but I am going to pick Noah. I'm going to spend everyone here. This could be enough for... Oh! Got the amazing. I think this fight and this game is done. This is a victory lap at this point. I don't need to heal. I don't need to do anything. Uh, there's the overkill. We have finished Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Let's do it right. Ah. <sighs> Experience bonus, sure. Well, I guess there is post game, right? You sure are, Neo. You sure are. This game is over. Or is it? Oh god damn it. What is this? Oh no. Wait, what? That's a good question. So basically preventing us from interlinking by just taking away the entire Agnes half of the party. Time for the final final boss, ZZT. This is what ZZT looks like. I gotta have some words with AC. The bossing X X infinite, I guess, yeah. Okay, that was scripted. I wasn't supposed to get up from that. So I'm guessing that uh, the Team Agnes and Eno um, are going to be fighting Y Infinite. 
But I'm pretty sure that the hard part of the fight was that point. Oh, hi. Forget your name. Not here, not now. All our hopes are won. They always yeah, have been and they always will be. You lot always have to make an entrance. Still, thank you. Okay, so these are these are effectively guest characters that are not even in our party. No matter how hard they try, you can't take them out seriously. I mean that's that's a reasonable. I mean, Nopon aren't really there to be taken seriously for, for most of it. Um, minor secret spoiler from Xenoblade 2. Nopon used to talk perfectly normally. But then one particular knock on from uh, from history decided, hey, I, I'm I'm a tiny dude. Maybe people would like me better if I act like a tiny dude. And so they just started talking like they do. They're more adorable than Eagles? Yeah, I can see that. So on to, on to the other side here. Thanks for waiting. Hey, Squirt. We were saving the best for later. Oh, you crazy bitch. Interesting that you would show up for the final. Cold of you to leave me behind. Good of you to show up. Now, to stamp out this evil at its source. If you think you can interfere, then you have missed. Hey look, Judas, how's it going? And yet you will make not a shred of difference. Um, so, like I mentioned, I did have someone look up, um, I, it's not worth being a chain attack right now, there's only three people in the actual party, but I did have someone look up how many bosses were left, and he said six. By my count, this is number five. So I'm guessing that we're probably going to fight like one last embodiment of Origin. Where everyone is going to show up. And by everyone, I mean everyone. Yeah, I do kind of recall like a similar um, a similar final fight rundown 
in uh, Xenoblade 1. I don't remember the final fight too much in Xenoblade 2, honestly, though. I remember one better. Like, I, in general, I remember, like, the people in 2 better than the people in 1. But I remember the ending of 1 being, like, a bunch of bosses, like, you fight the, the hard one and then you get, like, a bunch of easy ones that are kind of just there for, uh, set dressing more than anything. with the chain attack. Oh, look at that. He just pulled out the, uh, the Lucky 7 without my asking. He probably has it for the rest of the fight. I'm still going to take this fight seriously. I don't know how tough they've made this. I used my thinking muscles for this one. Still love that line, too. Right I used my thinking muscles for this one. This music has started to shred, what the hell? Uh, lands mean Senna, so avoid using Senna. Specifically going for the uh, for the Bravo here. Making sure to keep at least one non-healer active. Just in case I would end up drawing all healers again. So lands and Seta, Tion and Yumi. Started with the Lucky 7, ending with the Lucky 7. Ha <laughs> Right on the nose for Bravo. using my uh, my last order here to um, put down some fields because we're about to go back into regular combat. I don't know how much it matters, but uh, if it does...
That was a good quarter of his health right off the bat. Now that's dealing damage. Oh, this is going to be an actual fight, isn't it? I didn't know it go. So I guess he doesn't have the lucky seven for the rest of the fight. Giant head moving a buck silly. Yeah, it would. Smash that face. I do feel like we're getting a lot more heals than we were. Side of the chain attacks, fights look at, like an MMORPG. Maybe that's kind of part of why I like this. Is that, that's base, that's definitely the 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 feel that I got, especially from uh, Xenoblade Cross, which was the first one I played. Yeah, I think that's why I ended up playing it for like... Oh lord, how many hours. And also twice. So far it is the only... Uh, it is the only Xenoblade game that I have finished twice. And that's without the online content, because the first time I played it... Um... I just didn't have the opportunity to play online just for, for a variety of reasons. And the second time I was playing it emulated. Unfortunately right now that's the only way that I'm going to be able to play is you know, Blade Cross because, because um, I kind of bricked my Wii U. It's recoverable but I, I would need to do a hard mod. Just have this doubt fight happen in the middle of our fight. The queens have decided to join in directly. Just a bit more, give it everything. This will finish it. Zed, that future of despair you thought of. Just watch, because we're about to change it. Huh. More where that came from. Give it up. Save it. Okay. Someone else might want to hang back. 
in front of the robot the rest of our team is fighting? Wait, do you, do you think the queens are robots? No, these are the real deal. Like these are the, both of these are the true are the uh, the true queens. Ow, that are a little. the cons for robots. True. Well, there were Titans. Mechonus was a robot. Bionis was a flesh Titan. God damn it, Noah died again. I wait for landing center to uh, deal in. And actually, doing this one with the uh, the chain attack song, interesting. I don't like how many how many uh, players that spent though. I don't think that's gonna be a very good chain attack. Oof. Um, and lands is not one of my options. Crap. Well, I could get lucky. I could get lucky. Let's see what happens. Mm. I don't know that your thinking muscles are gonna be enough for this one, man. But let's try. No, that would have need to get up to 80. No luck this time. Which one's gonna happen first? Are we gonna get our chain attack or are we gonna get uh, Zed Infinite down? Yeah? 
I put up a prediction, but I'm pretty sure it was just you right now, Tyrion. And also, I'm in the middle of a boss fight. <laughs> I suppose if I was on a bigger uh, channel, I'd have mods that could do it for me. But there's a reason why I'm not doing anything more on that on Saturdays. Well, that answers my question. Or I'm about to chain attack again. Let's do it. This is probably, unless I bungle this horribly, going to finish the game for realsies. I feel like it's probably appropriate for us to finish with no one Neo. doesn't matter, we're reactivating everyone for the final. It's a low damage percent, that's the only thing that I'm worried about right now. Because we didn't get Eno, we got all pools. So this may not quite do it, but if it doesn't, it's gonna be awful close. Finish with an amazing? Well, we sure can't. Actually, it might be. We'll see. I mean, the fight's still over, but it's a little anticlimactic. Anticlimactic if I do it in the regular mouth. That's it. We done.
What power? Crazy. This is the force of people's will. You taking the mick? It's terrifying. Not knowing how tomorrow will turn out. How you will. But still, you can't just hold it in place. If you did that, you'd never change. You can't change the world like that. That's why I want to move on. We'll claim the future and shape it ourselves. And when you cannot choose, what well, then? In that desperate moment, we'll all be there to soothe you. The self is all that exists. As such, the only cure for despair is total oblivion. That is the face of the world. I hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. This rotten world, I love it. You're just being pissy because you lost. Also, you're not wrong, Tyrion. Everyone attacked at the same time, but still, eh? I would rather have done it during the chain attack. What's that light? It's coming from inside Origin. No, the cries of Mobius, but the sheer ferocity of it. Noah, Mio. Oh no, we're in an anime. And M. So he didn't disappear back then. Mm-mm. They were inside, with us. Think about it. They're still really the same people. We were conceived from regret. Sorry. Unlike you, who sprung forth from hope. Regret is our be-all and end-all. If only we'd made the right choice. If only things had been different. Blindly, we never try to change ourselves. Wishing only that the world would instead. We clung to the egotistical dream of being together forever. But that's only natural. Anyone would wish for that. Nothing to be ashamed of. Thank you. But now, our prolonged existence here, it only serves to strengthen those within this frozen moment in time who would keep it thus. So you see, we have but one choice here. Stop it! M! M! Don't do it! We'll think of a way to deal with Mobius! What you see over there is not Zed or Mobius, but a single, intense desire. Your thoughts, they can never affect a desire. But we, we who embody that very same desire... You can just stay here! Please, stay! Walk Have you learned nothing? We can Noah. walk it together. Noah's right. You've done enough. You don't have to do this. Uh, yeah, they do. You can finally be here together. Such kindness. Your eyes, they brim with it. I ask myself, were our eyes the same on that day? No, Mia, but we came from different 
worlds, we were able to leave a life behind. It was our hope for the future. Our hearts and our dreams intertwined. And we were given the chance to weave new life. And therefore, it's all good. Believe in yourselves. All of you will certainly reach heights that we were unable to. You guys can surely make it. You can take our place in the future. And just taking their talking as a free action uh, to the very limit of the concept there. Zed and the other Mobius, they wanted to protect the world too. That's why they created one they could control. I see where they were coming from. That's something that we feel almost every day. Having to change, to continue to change, that's sparking scary. But we can say this, even if we are reborn later, right then, what we think and feel that moment is real. To sacrifice that is never the right way. If you can't be true to yourself, then you're doing something wrong. Are you content with your decision? Uh. Very soon, the stilled flow of time will restart. You can change your mind if you act now. Ah, uh -uh. You did not just tell us to become Mobius. Yeah, can you even imagine? Uh, Noah? Why are you wavering, Noah? Some want to go on, and some want to stay. In this world, there are so many mingled desires. But do we, does anyone have the right to choose? Oh, don't you start minding us now. Just having the chance to be born in that world you make, that'll be plenty. So, you know, you just gotta do it your way. Gondor. Eh, uh, though if I can, I might want a better name, eh? Noah, all of us here want the same thing. It's how the future should be. Yeah, you're right. The future is right there. Believe in the actions you've taken, in your friends. And above all, you should believe in yourselves. Well then, the answer's simple. It's not every day that you wake up and get to watch two planets run into each other. Although I guess in this case, it kind of was every day, wasn't it? Well, 
It's a matter of who's going to be awake to see it. Come on! Ain't got all day! Yeah. I know. Right with you. What would the electric sword do? I realized there's something I haven't said yet. Oh, yeah? I haven't thanked you. What's this now? Thank you for sticking with me. Without you by my side, I'd never have made it here. Oh, come on. You had to say that? I'm serious here. I know you are. Huh? Listen, Noah, I feel just the same. Without you, I think my wishes would never have come true. I see. I guess so. Hmm. So I'll say it too. Thank you, Noah. Truly. We weren't half bad as a team, were we? Yeah, uh, passable, for sure. Just passable? I'm sure you meant <laughs> unsurpassable, right? <laughs> oh, I think I'll let you decide the passing grade, Lancy. Ah, uh, come Lancy. on, weirdo. Guess... We won't be working out together anymore. Yeah. I'm not keeping tabs, but don't you slack off. I am not gonna slack off! I'll train every day, thinking of you. Yeah. Same here. Yeah. Uh -huh. What's this? A herbal tea recipe. If you have to dry your own leaves, you should manage. Isn't this kind of pointless? Pointless? I mean, if the worlds are going to drift apart again, this paper won't last. <laughs> hmm? I considered that, of course. The paper and the ink, it all comes from your world. And the leaves with the tea? Even those and all? What do you think? <laughs> we'll check you out. Who am I if not scrupulous? Who? Well, you're my best bud. Fourth best, to be exact. <laughs> fourth best? Only fourth? Huh. Wait a minute. There's Noah and Lance. And did she count Joran? Oh, why am I only listing guys? Just, just chill out, <laughs> Tyon. Um, uh... What's up? Is there a problem? Well, uh, at least put me second or even third. Fourth seems a little harsh. <laughs> I'll think about it. Freaking! Oh, no, no! <laughs> Finally! Our world 
kids in their current states are still young. If in passing, they do themselves harm. I suppose even then they cannot but carry on. Still, I have faith. Even if now we become separated for a time, one day we'll surely get to walk hand in hand again. Everyone, thank you. Is that the Nado? Well, hello. I will see you soon, then. Oh wow, things have happened over there. This is the truth of our world. Memories melt in the morning light, and then a new day begins. Roads stretch out before us. So many paths. Which do you choose? That's up to you. Sometimes you might run astray. You'll stop, maybe cry in frustration. But you know, that's all right. For the roads, they go on without end. So look up, face forward, toward your chosen horizon. And just walk on. And there we go. There is no more. Well, there is a lot more, actually. There's a lot of um, side quests and a couple of uh, hero quests as well as ascension quests for... Also, look at all the alphabet there. But yeah, ascension quests for like every hero who is not one of the main six. Um, I'm not going to be covering any of those on stream. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think that I'm getting, that I have enough of an audience to keep doing, um, an extra stream on Saturdays. So I'm just going to not. Uh, I do have a plan for Saturdays in May, uh, which is going to take about um, two or three streams, probably. And there's a very specific reason I'll do it, but we'll get to that in May. 
but between now and May, there will be no more Saturday streams. Just to let you know. But this game, man. <laughs> there is definitely some frustrating parts about it. And there's like a lot to do and there's just too much to actually cover in a proper like stream series. But um that just means there's gonna be a, a lot more for me to do after we're done. And I would absolutely suggest, like, it, it, if this seems like an interesting game to you, play any of the Xenoblade series. Play the entire thing. Just have the time for it, because they are time-consuming games. This is, this is uh, session 20, so... Just to give you an idea. Ah. Have the time and energy for it. Yeah, I can I can definitely see energy as well. But I like it is nice that this is a game that is on the Switch. And what that means is you can just bring it everywhere with you. <laughs> and play it on the bus for for half an hour if you really want to. The only Xenoblade game that's not on the Switch right now is Cross, and I'm sad about that because it's honestly, it, just for being the first one and having a customizable main character is probably one of my favorites. Which is not to say I didn't enjoy this, like <laughs> they're all pretty close together. But the, the formula just gotten, in general, has gotten a lot better, I feel. I still kind of miss the, the, the art spar at the, at the bottom. A switch, like, press, like, left and right to pick which art you want to use and then use that. I don't know, I kind of like that system. It is a little bit prone to error, though, so I, I understand why they would have changed it. It's like you're, you're moving left and you move like one left too many and use the wrong, the wrong thing. And even worse, use your talent art at the wrong time when you weren't, when you weren't trying to use it. I do hope that they have a Xenoblade 2, uh, a, a Xenoblade Cross 2 at some point. There's still, like, a lot of stuff that is very much unanswered. X wasn't that popular, Cross wasn't that popular. Maybe not, I don't know. That doesn't mean that a cross 2 wouldn't be popular. It's kind of the same thing, like... Not exactly the same, but a similar thing to... Uh, Final Fantasies 11 and 14, right? Because they, they're the online ones, and not everyone's going to be quite as into it, but some people are going to be super into it. And I feel like if they had a little bit more, um, like, in-world online stuff... In any case, I feel like one thing that I would really want to do at this point, and so something that I've kind of wanted to do is actually learn the 
learn the flute, learn the um, send-off song, and then uh, cosplay as a Kevis soldier with someone else cosplaying as an Agnes soldier who's also done the same thing and, you know, play the song together. It's a, it's a dumb idea, but it's something that I would love to be able to do. Unfortunately, I just don't have the money for a cosplay. I definitely don't have the skills to make something myself. But, uh, since we're still uh, scrolling through the credits, uh, let me go over the schedule here. So the next scheduled stream is immediately following this one, actually. Uh, so if, if uh, whoever is interested in sticking around, I will be doing the um, final day of uh, the Advent of Code. Um, just as soon as we're done here. Am I gonna finish it? Probably not. But uh, usually they tone down the difficulty for day 25. So we'll see what happens. I just checked actually the program for day 24. It's still running. I don't know how long it's gonna be running. I don't have much hope for it. But uh, oh well, I guess I didn't beat my record from last year. Uh, the next stream after that is going to be tomorrow at um, 8 p.m. or later, Atlantic Standard Time. Provided that we have at least two players, we're going to be doing the uh, Sunday Super Shuffle. If it's just me, there won't be a stream. But if there's anyone else, there will be. Uh, and next stream after that is going to be on Tuesday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Standard Time. I guess let's finish this cutscene. Oh. Noah! What are you doing, man? They'll start the fireworks without us. Get a move on already, or all the good spots will be taken. Exactly, so come on, move it! Sorry! I zoned out for a sec. I'm coming. Z Noah zoned out? I'd never believe it. Wait, this all feels so familiar, doesn't it? Maybe he has somewhere else to be. And that's the end. Uh, so the uh, next stream is going to be, uh, next stream after uh, Sunday is going to be the, um, Long run stream, we're going to continue our run of Spyro, Year of the Dragon Reignited. And that takes us round week, round wheel to nothing. <laughs> because as I mentioned, there ain't no more streams on Saturday until May. Setting levels at rest spots. You can now use the level up function at rest spots to lower your character's levels as well. Doing so will net you bonus experience for any levels you choose to give up. Here are accessories. You can set your hero's accessories from the Characters Accessories uh, option in the main menu. Special weapons. 
These can be equipped from clothing attachments to give your weapon a very special appearance, usable class, sword fighter only. But basically changes the Lucky 7 to the Minato, I guess. Will you save the game? Of course I will. Why wouldn't I? It's good to if I don't record. save the game now, um, I don't get to save the game. As the morning sun rises, my lingering memories fade. I no longer see your silhouette. It's too far gone into the haze. But hey, it's all right. I won't forget you. Not until we can meet again. I swear it. Oh, it changes the uh, the theme song, or the the title screen. Well, so that's gonna do it for this stream. Once again, if you want to uh, hang around for the advent of code, we'll get started in about fifteen minutes. Uh, just gotta get things all ready and set up. But if you're not, or if you're watching from YouTube. I'm cool here if you don't know. I'll see you guys next time.